Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Lab by Chetan S. Noria, and today we're going to do a speed test between the Galaxy S6 Edge and the Galaxy S9 Plus. This is going to be a little funny as there is a huge difference between the Galaxy S6 Edge and the Galaxy S9 Plus. We are comparing the Exynos 7420 with the Exynos 9810 and 3GB of RAM with 6GB of RAM. That is a huge difference right there. And you can tell that the Galaxy S6 Edge won't be able to keep most of the applications open in the background. But I just love that device. It was the first device to come up with dual curved display. Just amazing. So guys, for the test we have some applications that you must use on the daily basis. So in the first row, we have some system applications like phone, camera, Samsung health and Samsung music. In the next row, we have some social networking apps, which you all love to use. So we have Facebook, Instagram, YouTube and Twitter. Let's move on to the gaming row now. Here we have Subway Surfer, Blood, Aswell Nitro and Pinout. And in the last row, we have networking apps that you might use on a daily basis for shopping or journal browsing. So we have Amazon Shopping, Food Panda, Quora and Internet. And at the last, we have Clock application to clock the timing of both the devices. So let's get into it. First of all, we close all the applications and move on to the Clock app to start the clock at the same time. And at the first, the S9 Plus has the lead and it is running through the applications. So now the S9 Plus seems to be stuck at Facebook and the S6 Edge has caught up. And the funniest thing is the S6 Edge has opened the Facebook application faster than the Galaxy S9 Plus. So they are really close right now. But the S6 Edge is stuck at YouTube now. The S9 Plus has moved on to the gaming row and the S6 Edge is right behind it. The S6 Edge is loading the Subway Surfer and the S9 Plus is already at as well Nitro. So as well Nitro is a great game and it is really light on the storage as well. You feel a little bit of stutter here and there, but nevertheless, it is a storage friendly game. So the S6 Edge has a little bit of trouble in the Asphalt Nitro by getting all these advertisement and extra stuff. The S9 Plus has moved to networking row now and is at Quora now. And the S6 Edge is still at Asphalt Nitro. That is a huge performance difference right there. The S9 Plus has completed its first lap and now is checking if all the applications are open in the background. And the S6 Edge has finally moved on to pin out. Whereas the Galaxy S6 Edge is still at gaming row, the Galaxy S9 Plus is checking if the Instagram is still open in the background. So the Galaxy S9 Plus has already completed its second lap as well, but the S6 Edge is still on the networking row. And the S6 Edge is really close to completing its first lap now. It is a great performance by the Galaxy S9 Plus right there. So the Galaxy S6 Edge has finally completed its first lap and we're gonna speed it up for the Galaxy S6 Edge to complete its second lap as well. Now it is checking if all the applications are open in the background. Now the pinout as well nitro are closed in the background so they have to be reloaded. The block is closed as well. It is being reloaded once again and also the survey surfer. Twitter is also closed. YouTube is also closed. I would say it is a good performance but the Galaxy S9 Plus shines through it. And the S6 Edge has finally completed its two lap with the timing of 4 minutes and 29 seconds. It is almost twice the time the Galaxy S9 Plus took to complete its two lap. So guys, fair and square the Galaxy S9 Plus won. The Galaxy S9 Plus clearly outperformed its ancestor in terms of both app opening time and keeping the apps open in the background. But the funniest thing was that the S6 Edge was faster in opening Facebook app than the Galaxy S9 Plus. So guys, we all knew that the Galaxy S6 Edge would lose. But it was the question of by how much it would lose. 
And that definitely shows us how great the new devices are getting. So guys, I hope you liked this video. And if you're new here, please subscribe to this channel. And do follow me on Instagram as well. This is Chetanesh Noria, signing off.